Hello, everybody, and welcome at EPS Days Jakarta. We are live on all the possible networks where we can stream this video. Uh, we are live on the Hopin platform where EPS Jakarta is 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 um, is being uh, is being uh, streamed, but we're also live on LinkedIn, also live on Twitter. So yeah, glad to be able to talk to you about the first EPI conference of the year of the EPI Day series, uh, and we're really glad to start by EPI Day Jakarta. My name is Mehdi Mejawi. I'm the founder and chairman of EPI Day's conferences, a conference series that has been created in 2012, and that is celebrating its 57th event. And we're glad to do this second edition in uh, uh, in Jakarta, a place where there is a vibrant community of API practitioners, and with our local organizer, John, uh, that uh, will introduce you the program of the event. We are glad to present you a, a, a really wonderful event with uh, great speakers from the local communities, but also from all Southeast Asia, Asia Pacific, and even from uh, all the world where the time zone is actually friendly. You know the current situation, COVID-19 still has some impacts on physical events, but we still try to deliver our mission to connect human behind APIs. And so we do it remotely. We do it with online platforms as APIs would do, right? And so we're really glad to provide you this conference and make for the first time the keynote available in streaming, right? Um, so if you want to access to the full conference, you can go on apis.co or apis.global and you can register to the full conference uh, there. So let me just share my screen to tell you a little bit what's, what will be going on uh, about, uh, about EPI Day Jakarta, uh, right? So it's a second edition, right? We had a first edition last year. And um, as I said, the mission is really to connect the human behind APIs and we will fulfill our mission, whatever, in real life or online. And this is what we're providing for you today. So we will have speakers, we'll have attendees, we'll have sponsors, you know, influencers of the community. So join us on epids.global, uh, where you will be able to uh, uh, register to the event in Jakarta that is going live. In, in some numbers, we've, we've done more than 57th event uh, uh, so far. We almost had uh, 38,000 attend past attendees for more than uh, 14 countries where we organize conferences, 22,000 companies and more than 2,400 speakers. So really the core of the community is there. And we have an online community of 200,000 members that follow us on social media, newsletters, or in our uh, email base. So yeah, strong of this community. Uh, we are organizing event all of the year. So we are currently in Jakarta now, but just to say, if you go on our website, you will be able to see all the events of the series uh, in, in USA, in Europe, or other events in Asia Pacific. If you want to organize events in South America or Africa, tell us, we will be glad to help you organize these events with us. Two initiatives I wanted to talk about uh, before going, li going live in Jakarta and with John who will tell us exactly the program we will have today. The first initiative I want to share as a global uh, series of conferences are women in API initiatives. So we we know that in tech there is a kind of there is a gender diversity issue, and our women in API initiative enables uh, women to be onboarded in a program of speaking engagements, uh, speaking coaching, training, and even career coaching from other experts of the community. Most of the time female, but again, coaching can come from anywhere. But at least we want really to nurture a new community of uh, female speakers and female attendees who, who wants to uh, feel comfortable by attending API conferences or speak at API conferences. And even like take really strong senior leadership API positions uh, uh, a job. So if you know a female that should be known in the community or if you are a female uh, that uh, that consider that, uh, yeah, you have things to share with the community, don't hesitate to join our Women API initiative. Don't hesitate to apply to be speaker to our events. The second initiative I want to share with you is our media platform, you know, uh, apiscene.io. So if you go on apiscene.io, you will be able to see uh, content generated by our, our community of speakers, of attendees, or sponsors sometimes that deliver news about APIs, stories on a technical side or on a business side about, let's say, the programmable economy. So APIC.io is the place to learn about media stories, uh, API stories uh, uh, on the media dedicated to API stories powered by API days. 
just to uh, 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 for today, don't hesitate uh, to use our tweet to follow our Twitter account. So slash uh, 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 hashtag API days if you want to tell tell and tweet about the event. Uh, even if the event is online, we still need uh, to uh, spread the word out that APIs needs to be included in every digital transformation. So yeah, by using this hashtag, you will be able, you will be able to do it, or you can just mention us at API Days Global for uh, uh, being sure that we uh, uh, see your notification and we retweet you or like your tweet for sure. I'll let now uh, the stage to John, John Shield, our local organizer and partner over the last uh, years, who is the local organizer of API Days Jakarta and who will tell us more about the program. So John, uh, yep, I invite you to uh, to take the screen and share um, the, the program and some details about the event we'll have today in Jakarta. Thanks very much, uh, Mehdi, and uh, I really, uh, really appreciate being able to uh, bring API Days to Jakarta once, once again. So as Mehdi mentioned, this is the second edition. We, we had um, an online edition of uh, API Days Jakarta last year. The, the theme then was connecting the digital stack. Uh, we, the, the, our theme for this year is accelerating digitization because even if you didn't think you needed to be a digital company uh, before, you certainly do now. And uh, so we, we have a great lineup uh, of, uh, of speakers to share with you the topics related to both the business and the technology of digitization and a with APIs as the, as the building blocks, as the connectors. So we have several um, tracks, um, but we're going to start with two keynote presentations. Firstly, from Juan Wang, who's the Chief Technology Officer at Gurung Ada. It's a, uh, an Indonesian startup that is connecting the dots to the, the, the last mile um, of, of logistics, which uh, it, we really need to make sure that although we, we're digitizing, we're, we're crossing the, the boundaries between online and offline. So he's going to give a great perspective on how to achieve that in Indonesia. Then he'll be followed by our second keynote speaker, Todd Schweitzer, who's the CEO and co-founder of Brankus. Um, Brankus is a great um, API enabling company in Southeast Asia, and Todd is going to give uh, his perspective on how to connect the digital economy in Southeast Asia with, through APIs. After the two keynotes, we're going to um, we, we'll take a short break and then we'll break into several stages. So we'll have a uh, on the left hand side what we call the enterprise stage, which is really about the the, the business and organisational capabilities that you need to build to. Uh, achieve this uh, digital transformation. Uh, so, uh, and we, we have our first track on, on that stage. Uh, we'll have speakers from, from IBM, Alan Glickenhaus from, from IBM will talk about uh, how to overcome the three largest obstacles to digital transformation. We'll hear from um, Udi from, uh, from Bank Record, Rack out uh, Indonesia about how you actually redefine uh, banking uh, with with APIs, and we'll also hear from Gavin Tan from Brick about how financial services can be hyper personalized, um, particularly in the Southeast Asian concept uh, uh, context. And then we're going to hear from uh, Ryan Chow, uh, who's the the identity product lead at NTUC Enterprise, about how customer identity can uh, achieve social good. On the technical stage, we'll dig a little bit deeper into how you actually connect these, these things. So we're going to hear uh, from uh, speakers who will talk about the, the detail of, of integration and how you make it work in your technology environment. So we're calling this track, uh, the connected apps, uh, is really about the front end to the back end to, uh, to, to the rest of the, your, your infrastructure. At the same time as, as that, we'll, we'll have workshops from our, our sponsors. The first workshop is from uh, Vonage, uh, building a customer engagement through a video API. And we're also going to hear from 
uh, IBM. So the, the workshops are an opportunity to give you a, a deep, deeper dive into the uh, how you how you actually build things with uh, uh, with the, these technologies. We'll also have uh, roundtable conversations, which are smaller events that are much more interactive, that are led by um, uh, a moderator and, and and one of our sponsors. So the first one will be from from Confluent at ten forty five a.m. These times are in Jakarta time, so if you're um, dialing in from somewhere else, then just take note of the the time difference. Uh, that so that's the that's the morning session. In the afternoon session, we continue the the uh, the enterprise stage. We're we're dealing with. Um, uh, the, the afternoon session on the enterprise stage is about connecting products. So APIs as a product, how you product package your, your uh, products, whether they're physical or digital, and uh, share them uh, through, through APIs, whether they're data, whether they're uh, other services that you provide, how you actually package that up through an API. Um, the technical stage deals with um, connecting, uh, connecting the dots with all of these, um, with all of these technologies, microservices, event driven, and uh, and the difference between uh, between these different technologies and and how how they um, how they interact. So uh, again, we'll have we'll continue to have more uh, speakers. Uh, and then we, uh, the afternoon, we'll take a short break after those tracks to continue with the, um, the enterprise stage about connected services. So we're going to hear from uh, industries such as financial services, telecommunications, e-commerce, uh, logistics, and um, it's, um, so we, we're going to have a great view across industries about how you digitize.